Today in this video, I am going to show you how you can take a screenshot on Windows 10 for free. First we'll look at how you can take a screenshot just by using your keyboard. Then we'll look at some tools that are included directly with Windows 10 that will allow you to take screenshot directly without using keyboard and I will show you how you can edit your screenshots using some tools. All these methods are completely free, so just make sure you watch the video till the end. So, let's get started. Method 1. Use your keyboard to take a screenshot. Most keyboards include the print screen key you'll typically find this near the F12 key on your keyboard. Sometimes it goes by print screen and other times it'll include an abbreviation. If you have desktop keyboard, simply press print screen on your keyboard and you will get the screenshot of the entire screen. Same goes with the laptop keyboard. Once you take a screenshot, this screenshot is placed on your clipboard. Now, you can open up an app like Word, PowerPoint or Paint and you can paste it by pressing Ctrl V. The print screen works great if you want to take a screenshot of your entire desktop screen, but sometimes you just want a screenshot of just one application, website or window that you are currently working on. To take a screenshot of just one window, simply press the Alt key together with print screen. This will take a screenshot of just the currently active window. Now, you can paste this screenshot in any editing app you like and edit it by adding some text and then save it. Now, I will show you how you can get access to multiple screenshots that you have taken from your keyboard. For this you need to turn on Clipboard History. Simply press the Windows key together with the V key. By default, when you take a screenshot, you'll only have one screenshot on your clipboard so by simply turning on Clipboard History, you will be able to choose which screenshot you want to paste if you have taken multiple screenshots. Now let's take a screenshot of one window again and I'll take a screenshot of the other window. I'll press Windows V and here I can choose which screenshot I want to paste. Now, I will show you how you can automatically save your screenshot as a picture in Picture Folder. If you are playing game or watching movie, you just want it to automatically save the screenshot. Simply press Windows key with print screen and that'll take a screenshot of the entire screen. It will automatically save in pictures without using paste into any document software. Method 2. Taking a screenshot by using a tool. You can also take a screenshot of any part of your screen using a tool. Simply open Snipping Tool. Click on New. Now you can snip any part of the screen and save it anywhere on your desktop. You can also launch Snipping Tool by pressing the Windows key together with Shift and S. Here I can take a rectangular snip. Once I highlight the area, this will add that to my clipboard in the bottom right hand corner. I can see this toast notification and if I click on that that will bring me to a very basic editor. That allows me to annotate my screenshot. You can add ink annotations. You can highlight and you can also crop your image. I hope you have understood how you can easily take screenshots in your desktop. Let me know down below in the comments what is your favorite method of taking a screenshot.